Um, hi, I'm Rob Bayless. I'm the Associate Director at Cal Performances, and we created Front Row um, three years ago now. And the intention behind creating Front Row was to um, bring students into the curatorial process at Cal Performances and to offer the students at the campus a platform where for one night in our season, um, they can create really whatever they want on our stage. So the process is that we gather together nine to 12 student curators who stay with us for about a six month process. Uh, I think it's, it's really special that it's all curated by students because I think we all represent, we're like a microcosm of the campus because we all come from different majors and different communities on campus and we're a really diverse like cohort of curators. Um, and I think that allows us to really speak for students uh, in a way that the people who work at Cal Performances might be able to understand to an extent, um, but we really truly understand the campus climate and what students want and need from a show like this. I think the, the value of having a student curation committee is that the committee can speak to some of the issues and things that the students actually want to talk about. The um, decision making around who the star of the show will be is really the first step of the process with the students and oftentimes there's a list that will be generated of people who the curators are thinking hmm this person has really impacted my life or it's really in is interesting to me or has a real value proposition for our campus at this moment um, and bit by bit we will vet that list down to one specific star and see if we can go out and make that offer to that individual. I, I really wanted to laugh. Uh, I wanted to have some fun. Um, so I personally thought Margaret Cho was just um, the right choice in that sense. Um, moreover, uh, I think she can speak to a lot of issues that are really pertinent to the campus community right now. Um, I mean, we're talking a lot about identity um, here at Berkeley. We're talking a lot about you know, what does it mean to be, you know, to be human, to be to be part of humanity, to be alive. Uh, to, to advocate for people, to, to be involved in politics. Margaret is so folk, like her comedy is so focused on her identity uh, as like a Korean American woman, as a queer woman. Um, and we knew that that was really important both to Margaret and to students on campus. So we wanted to frame the show around that. And just having, we had an opportunity to bring like people of color into the, into the light through Front Row. So we kind of just like took that and ran with it. Um, and she's really receptive. She's really interested in talking about race and identity as well. And what we offer them is the opportunity to create a one night only mashup of all the things in people that excite them, that inspire them, um, and to really create something that will be unduplicated in the world. It happens for one night at Berkeley. It takes six months to make it. Um, and it's, it's a totally original program that's really just devised by the students. I guess one thing I want um, people to walk away from with the show is this uh, this attitude of what's next. You know, if they were able to walk into a show, listen to things about politics, and laugh together as a, a you know as a cohesive group, um, why not be able to do that um, in your daily conversations as well? And I think that makes the show really special because we would have really candid conversations about race and our identities and what we wanted to see um, from Cal performances. In, in those really candid conversations, we're able to like form this show and we were very careful in particular about what we wanted to talk about and what we felt was important. Um, and I think that will make a show that's much more for students than anything that somebody who isn't like a student on campus could do.